pretty awesome, right? A screen mirror any iPhone to your Xiaomi TV. Completely free, it's wireless, and the best part is that you don't have to download any third-party apps on your iPhone. Everything is built into it. And it's so, so smooth, you can see it. I can take photos, I can view photos on my TV. It's pretty awesome. Let's just dive right into it. All right, so the first thing you need to do on your iPhone, again, it doesn't matter what iPhone you have, this will work with literally any iPhone. First thing you need to do is to make sure your iPhone is connected to your home Wi-Fi connection. That is super, super important, okay? In this case, as you can see, I am connected to my home Wi-Fi, which is super important. Next up, let's just say if you don't have home Wi-Fi, you can always use your mobile hotspot. Again, it's not recommended because mobile hotspot will use your mobile data and depending on where you live, depending on what data plan you have, it's not recommended. So just use your home Wi-Fi. It's super, super easy. It's homey. There you go. Next up, we need to do is to make sure your TV is also connected to that exact same home Wi-Fi connect that we connected our iPhone to. As you can see, I am connected to my home Wi-Fi and that is pretty much all you have to do. Just make sure your iPhone and your Xiaomi TV are both connected to the same Wi-Fi connection. Next up, go to the Play Store on your Xiaomi TV. As you can see, every TV has a Play Store. It's a Google Play Store, obviously. It's pretty cool. And you need to download a free app called AirPlay Mirror, okay? It's completely free. As you can see, I've done this before and it's I cannot download it again, obviously, for obvious reasons. Just download it. It's completely free. I'm not getting paid by these guys. It's absolutely awesome. It's one of the most awesome apps on the Google Play Store, which which lets us screen mirror any iPhone to the TV completely free, okay? So you don't have to download anything on your iPhone. Next up, we need to make sure the iPhone is connected to the exact same Wi-Fi connection. I cannot say this enough, it's super important. As you can see, I'm connected. Now, what you need to do is open up the AirPlay app that we downloaded on the TV, as you can see. This should look exactly like this, okay? Also, if you want to change the, if you want to change the name, you can do that by using, going to the settings. I've done this before, <laughs> pretty cool. And next that we need to do is to bring the iPhone and let's do this, okay? Now, once you do this, as you can see, I have my iPhone, go to the control center. Inside the control center, you should be able to see something called screen mirroring right there. Let's just say if you, right there, see, it's pretty cool. It will automatically show you all the TVs, but let's just say if you don't have that, you can just tap and hold on your control center and add, add a control. Just type in screen mirroring and you should be able to see screen mirroring right there. You can add a screen mirroring. You can make it bigger as well, which is pretty cool. And there you, there you have it. You have a tiny and then you have a bigger one, which is pretty cool. Just tap on it and it should automatically show you the TV that is running in the background. It's same TV. Again, Xiaomi TV. Just click on your Xiaomi TV name and it should automatically be connected to your TV. Just wait a couple of seconds. As you can see, I'm waiting. It takes a couple of seconds. It takes a couple of seconds depending on how fast your internet connection is. And there you go. Pretty cool. We're connected. Well, that's that's it. That's that's how you screen mirror any iPhone to your Xiaomi TV completely free. Now, this is a this is an important note. The app actually lets you screen mirror for about 20 to 25 minutes, and then you have to repeat the cycle. So yeah, that's the only drawback. But per probably the best screen bring app on your uh, Xiaomi TV. So be sure to check it out. As you can see, you can take a photo and you can zoom in on a photo. You will show you, it will, sh it will show you the photo on your Xiaomi TV, which is pretty cool. But let me know in the comment section if, if you need any help, okay? Also, the audio will be coming from the TV. If you play anything on your iPhone, it will be played on your TV, which is pretty cool. Again, I'm not gonna play the audio for obvious reasons and if you, you can if you want if you play games you can actually play games too on your uh from your iphone to your xiaomi tv as you can see i play clash of clans not a lot but i do play, play clash of clans which is pretty cool by the way if it lags if it's lagging as you can see i'm it's lagging just give a couple seconds to regroup it will automatically stabilize on its own okay Next up, you can watch videos. Again, as I said before, the audio will be coming from the TV. No matter what you do, the audio will be coming from the TV. You can watch videos and every video you play will be played on the TV and the audio will also be played on your um, on your TV, which is pretty cool. And yeah, that's pretty much it. If, again, if you have any questions, just let me know in the comment section below. I'll definitely, definitely help you out, okay? And if you want to stop this, if you have a dynamic island, just tap on it. Or you could just go to the control center again, just like we did before. And just tap on the screen mirroring tab and click on stop mirroring. It will automatically stop the mirroring process. Pretty cool, pretty simple. If you want to do this all over again, just tap on the screen mirroring, just tap on the TV and there you go. 
Let's just take a couple seconds. <laughs> yep. There you go. We're, we're connected. Pretty awesome, right? Well, I'm Riz. I hope you enjoy the video. Um, be sure to subscribe to the channel, okay? I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out.